Okay, it is April 2021. Today I am flying from Washington Dulles Airport to Frankfurt, Germany, and then from Frankfurt to Zurich, Switzerland. My goodness, has it gotten more complicated to fly. Uh, currently, the rules are that in Germany, you need a PCR or certain types of rapid test results within the last 48 hours. If someone has any tips on how to get a PCR result quick, please let me know in the comments, but I'm still waiting for my PCR test result from yesterday at 11.30 a.m. Today it is 2 p.m., so it's been just over 24 hours. I did get a rapid test last night, so hopefully they will accept that. Uh, and if not, hopefully I'll get the results before from the PCR test before my flight leaves at about uh, 6 p.m. tonight. So I've got my N95 mask for when it gets crowded inside and my neoprene cloth mask, which I'm gonna put on for now. I'm gonna see if I can check in. The last time I was here was in December and they had a bunch of Christmas decorations up. So those are obviously gone. But as you can see, the airport is pretty empty. Not a lot of people trying to fly. Can't blame them. Safer to stay home, definitely. Uh, but let's see if I can do this. So I got my boarding pass. I feel a lot better now. A lot more relaxed. Looks like everything is gonna be okay. Uh, I'm gonna head to security now. Okay, I made it through security. Uh, I'm only traveling with a carry-on. Um, and my purse here. I don't know, I find it easier to not check a bag because well, with all the different flights and in case I don't make it or whatever, the flight is delayed. And I'm only going for a few days, so it's easy to travel with only a carry-on. Now I am going to head to the gate. Well, I made it to the gate. I am super early, it's two hours until boarding. So I'm gonna do some work now. So if you've watched any of my other videos, you know that I like to fly long distances with a clean, moisturized face. So this time I brought, I have these Olay wipes, which are dry, and then you just add a little bit of water. By the way, I cut this into like a small piece. <laughs> it comes a lot bigger usually, but I make four out of one. And then you just wipe your face with it. Sometimes it's easier to travel with these because they're lighter and they're not liquid. I don't need to bring liquid makeup remover. Don't really like dry my face with paper towels, but now I have some eye cream. And then I have this hyaluronic mask from my shell, which prevents my face from drying out during the flight. I don't think makeup tutorials are gonna be my calling. <laughs> Oh, and I got some in my eye. I'm gonna wait for this to dry a little, and then I'm gonna put my mask back on. 
My earring. Where is it? Where is it? Found it. Ready to go. The airplane just arrived. They've been unloading it and reloading some food. And boarding is in about 45 minutes. They just made an announcement that we're going to be boarding soon. And they also said that no cloth masks are allowed on the flight. So you either have to be wearing a surgical mask or an N95 mask. So I'm gonna be switching these now. So this is the first time I'm wearing one of these N95 masks. I've worn a lot of different kinds, but um, this one seems to have the best fit out of all the ones that I've tried. There's no air coming in anywhere along the edges, top or the bottom. Um, it feels very snug with these two bands. And there's also space around my mouth and my nose for me to be able to breathe properly. So this is what's gonna be keeping me safe. Every passenger was given one of these disinfecting wipes that I'm going to use to wipe any surface I might be touching frequently, like the armrests, the seat belt, the table. This is the amenity kit. We have a sleep mask and socks, a toothbrush, some moisturizer and lip balm. I'm going to take the socks and put them on over my own socks so I can take my shoes off. Your mouth and nose at all times during your stay on board. This measure provides additional protection for all of us here on board, and you may take off your mask for a brief time only when... Just got the menu. Let's see what we're going to eat today. I ordered the beet puree and barley salad, the salmon with vegetables and rice, and a cheese plate for dessert. Okay, so this flight is a lot fuller than I was expecting. Luckily, Everyone on the airplane has undergone a COVID test, so that makes me feel a little bit better. But I'm trying to minimize the amount of time I take my mask off. We just had dinner, I tried to eat it as fast as possible. Um, and now I am going to take a nap. I think we have about six hours left. Usually they wake you up for breakfast like an hour and 45 minutes before, so maybe I can get a good Three and a half, four hours of sleep. Got some hand cream here. My hands always dry out from washing them so much. And then I got my sleep mask to make sure I don't miss any food because that would be terrible. Just woke up. We have just under an hour and a half left and they have started serving breakfast. Made it off the plane. I need to take this mask off. The fit is great, but <sighs> need to get some air.
trying to find a information board so I can see what gate my next flight leaves from, even though it's not for another like four hours. So it might not even be listed yet, but at least I can get closer. Oops, my bad. So in Germany, you have to wear a surgical or N95 mask in, in any public areas. So I gotta switch back to this one. Um, there's signs everywhere in the airport and they're making announcements that you gotta wear um, a surgical or N95 mask. So no cloth masks, which is good um, for everyone's protection. So no complaints. Just bought something at Duty Free and now I'm sitting here with a friend. We're just having a little chat. went through passport control, which then took me through another <laughs> duty-free shop because they want you to buy all the stuff at the airports. And now I'm going to check out this awesome car right here. Looks pretty cool. I found a little corner to sit in and I bought some stuff, which I'm going to eat and drink now. I got a chai latte, a fruit smoothie, and a pretzel. Pretzels. We've got just over an hour until boarding for the next flight to Zurich. The flight is very full, so they just asked everyone with a large piece of hand luggage to check it in. So that's what I will be doing. And it looks like we're getting ready to board in maybe 20 minutes. As you can see, the flight is very full. We're just waiting for everyone else to board. Every passenger got their own water bottle, except I'm not gonna take my mask off during this flight. It's only 30 minutes and I'm gonna close my eyes for a little bit. landed in Zurich, Switzerland. Um, I was just given a contact tracing card, which is supposed to be filled out. Now they say you should do it online, but I got a paper one because we were not told that beforehand. They said we could still do it on board. So now I'm gonna fill this out and head over to baggage claim. Okay, I got my suitcase at baggage claim. Switch back to this one for a little bit. Uh, I'm gonna drop off this contact tracing paper and then I'm gonna figure out what train I need to take. So there's no one around to give my contact tracing form to. So I guess I'm gonna try to fill it out online anyway. This is where my video ends. I found the train tracks down here, got my ticket, and yeah, I hope this video was helpful. It was a little stressful. There were some new things to me that I hadn't done before, just trying to figure out everything and the rules keep changing, but 
the trip was a success and I wish you lots of success in your travels. Let me know in the comments where you're going or if you have any questions about the experience and I'll do my best to answer them.